the solo planar molder SH410 has become a much appreciated machine among carpenters and sawmill owners. The ability to re-saw and mold in one operation has solved many problems and saved a lot of working hours. The SH410 has a planing cutter head which is also equipped with a circular saw blade. This is what gives the machine its unique operation. The timber is fed through the machine by two feed rollers. There are two serrated feed rollers before the cutter head and one rubber coated roller after the cutter head. A powerful motor runs both the cutter head and the circular saw blade. In the SH410, the saw blade can be moved laterally for machining with or without resawing operation. The desired thickness is set by turning a crank. The timber is guided with the help of a straight fence and resilient press roll. To get the exact setting of the planing knives, you use a setting block made of aluminium. When you move the setting block over the knife, you can easily see if it is set in the right position. This is a quick and easy method to get accurate settings of the planing knives. When the knives are set at the right height, you secure them with the locking screws in the chip breaker. When the SH410 is used for resawing, you first set the width by using the straight fence. Then the press roll is set to a suitable position so that the board is pressed against the fence. The thickness is easily set by turning the crank for height adjustments. It only takes a couple of seconds to set the machine so that you get exactly the dimensions you desire. You can dimension the timber up to 240 by 75 millimeters. This is a quick way of getting a planed and resawn board in one operation. The saw blade gives a very fine surface, almost comparable with a planed one. Now we're going to use the SH410 for resawing only. The easiest way is to let the straight fence and press roll change places. Set the fence to the desired width and then move the press roll towards the fence as the project board gets narrower. The SH410 makes resawing timber both quicker and safer than an ordinary circular saw. Of course, the results become accurate every time. For planing the maximum width, you just move the saw blade to the side. Now, the large cutter head enables you to machine work pieces that are up to 410 millimeters wide and 250 millimeters thick. Together with a resawing height of up to 75 millimeters, you can accordingly plane and resaw very thick work pieces. Maximum takeoff is fully 6 millimeters. The high capacity of the SH410 involves quite a lot of shavings and wood debris. Due to this, a strong chip extractor should always be connected to the machine. Now it's time to show the first mounting of molding knives in the cutter head. For example, planing with a rounding. The molding knife is mounted on the pin of the chip breaker. The knife and the chip breaker are inserted in one of the extra tracks in the cutter head.
remember that all knives are to be mounted in pairs, for example, opposite to each other in the cutter head. The SH-410 is now set up for the easiest molding operation. The circular saw blade cuts away superfluous material. This makes the SH-410 the perfect machine for producing joists. The feed rate is 6 meters per minute as standard. But with the optional variable feed, you increase the speed for efficient production of construction timber. But the full potential of this planar molder lies in its molding operation. For example, when making cornices, the back of the molding is shaped by using two chamfering knives. We start by resawing a workpiece of the right dimensions. The backs of all cornices basically look the same. The front, however, can come in all imaginable shapes. Here we mount a so-called swan neck knife between the two chamfering knives. All knives for horizontal cutter heads in Logosol's planar molder program can be used. Logosol supplies knife sets with a wide selection of different molding profiles. And in our tool catalogue, you can choose from hundreds of different molding knives. To get an edge that is completely rounded, you have to have a knife that goes all the way down to the machine table. Due to this, the machine table is equipped with a plastic insert that protects the knives. This also means that you can machine both dry and wet timber with excellent feeding function. The SH-410 is now set up for producing panelling. First, the back of the panelling is machined dimensioning and moulding in one operation. The front is shaped with moulding knives for beaded T and G. When making the front side of panelling, the heartwood side of the workpiece should always be facing upwards. Also a relatively simple moulding can be nice to look at. With the optional attachment for making T and G profiles, you further increase the range of uses of this planer. First, you machine the board on one side, then on the other. The tongue is ready. After this, you install the TNG clamp and a suitable molding knife for the groove. This only takes a couple of minutes. Start the planer and let it finish the job. Now you have perfect panelling. The SH-410 is ideal for machining large dimensions. Start with dimensioning and planing the timber. Then you mould one side. Change moulding knives and mould the other side. 
In this case, the result is sturdy plank timber. For making a garden cabin, you need approximately 240 linear meters of plank timber. Plank timber with one unplaned side is sent through the machine three times. Altogether, you machine three times 240 meters, which equals 720 meters. The feed rate of the SH410 is 360 meters an hour. Accordingly, producing timber for a garden cabin takes two hours, plus 20 minutes at the most for resetting between different planing operations. Making floorboards is probably the most challenging job for a planer. These floorboards, which are made with a special profile with a bevel for nails, show that the SH410 can manage the toughest jobs without problem. The SH410 is much appreciated for its simplicity and versatility. This is the ideal machine when you want to take the next step in refining sawn timber. This is simply a miracle machine.